but I uh, thought I'd start the video today with a little look in the shell dwellers tank they spawned and I didn't even notice because them babies have got to be at least they've got to be at least a week old to be for even free swimming it's the first spawn from the little shell dwellers I think there's, I camped them earlier and they were all out and I put some flake in, there was about eight or nine. That's not bad for their second spawn when all of them got eaten in the first spawn, I think. That's the mum. And that's dad. Looking all angry. And that's the male that didn't make it. The nice thing is about these guys is they really don't they don't really attack each other too much and he's not trying to eat their fry going mad trying to eat it and they're nice. And little shellies. Stuck in love a bit of pofus in there the other day. Cuttings are hanging down again. see straight after I turned the video off I uh, checked a different cave just just to see if anyone had anything can they well they did just turn the bugger out and went focus with that in there there you go probably uh, only a small clutch I think it was one of the tiny males on the right hand side what's that six seven seven it's better than nothing there we go. Yeah, back on the for a bit. I moved all the ones that I caught last week and during this week over into this grow up box in here because they just get way too skinny when I leave them in the tank to grow up. I don't actually know how many I end up catching. Yeah. So mainly probably Four seven ones. There's quite a few. Oh, for free. How did he get in there? Absolute beast. God knows he's ready to go there. Let's clean that crappy old food out of there later. You have to keep all that shite out in case they eat it. There's another stowaway. Let's see if we can get him. do this one handed where am I going to drop everything again like I did last time 
it and sort of wait for them to flip round before we drag them up the dry bit. I got him. Did not drop him this time. couple of them escaped and ended up you can see him just down the right hand side of this back over there these are the better ones they golds but this one's got a lot of eggs in there like a double clutch I think we'll get the flashlight and come back up here shortly she's a beast what I do is I just grab all of them off Sort of every few hours or whatever, I've only had that in there since lunchtime. I've been out down the beach, but I'll pull that up, grab as many as I can get, and then, uh, yeah, repeat the process basically. That's what happens when you don't pull a cave. But to be fair, I was on holiday, so there's another one there. Got a big one. Yeah, I'll get a flashlight and have a try and have a look at these guys. There's a lot of moss growing out of that. So we're back about three hours later in my time. Try and get a flip shot and it plugs up his pine Can you see the babies that she's got in there? They're really looking good. Beautiful, beautiful black of those. He's an absolute beast, and there's mum just behind. Long. There's the couple that got out, they're just taking refuge down the side here. I think that's another, that's a female there, and that's a male there. And that's a young female there that I picked up off someone else. Hopefully, I'm probably going to pull these tomorrow after work. As you can see, he's already got another clutch of eggs in there. It's absolutely mental, really. Yeah. They didn't spawn for me, they didn't spawn for me, and then bang. It all happened at once. Alright, anyway, that was just a short video from me. Catch you in a bit.